Hello and welcome. You're watching NDTV 24-7. I'm Amitabh Brevi. In the Jessica Lal murder case, the Delhi High Court has decided that hostile witnesses, Bollywood actor Shan Munshi and Prem Sagar Manocha, a ballistics expert, should face a perjury trial. Seventeen other witnesses have been let off in this high-profile case. Nyakana spoke to the lawyer of one of those who have been let off. A very significant order has been delivered by the Delhi High Court today which has ordered that two key witnesses in the Jessica Lal murder case will now face trial for perjury in the lower case, uh, lower court. Uh, these are actor uh, Shayan Munshi and uh, ballistics expert uh, Prem Sagar Manocha. To talk about that, I'm now joined by Mr. Amit Chadda, who is the lawyer for one of the other 17 witnesses who have in fact been discharged in this case. Sir, uh, firstly, how significant is this order? This is quite significant because it will definitely give a strong message to the society and at the same time uh, the uh, this honorable division bench has even referred the matter to another bench and has uh, given directions that it be treated in the form of a PIL in respect to the witness protection program so that in case in future the people they uh, restrain themselves from coming forward so once these guidelines are in the fray so people will have a uh, uh, more secure atmosphere and uh, protection in fact witness protection program there. is something that's always talked about so much in the so context much. of criminal trials also sir talking specifically about the role of these two men who will face perjury charges what are the grounds on which this ha this order has been delivered yes yeah, far as shan munshi is concerned he was basically the complainant in this matter and on whose instance the fir was lodged Later on in the day when he appeared in the court, he retracted from his statement completely. So this was the ground on which he has been, uh, this matter has been referred to be prosecuted under 340 CRPC. And as far as Prem Sagar uh, Minocha is concerned, he was the ballistic uh, expert. On, and uh, he has lodged two word theory and this was the reason why his matter has also been referred before the magistrate court to be initiated in the 340 CRPC. Right. Sir, finally, how much, uh, uh, what is the quantum of punishment that these men could actually face? See, under perjury, it can be up to seven years. Uh -huh. So now it is for the trial court to see how the trial process uh, takes place and what is the evidence before the trial court that the prosecution will prove. So thanks so much for speaking to us. Of course, it's not very often that we see uh, hostile witnesses facing perjury charges. Of course, uh, the last time we saw something like this was in the case of Zahira Sheikh, the high-profile witness in the best bakery case related to the post Gotra rights. She was sentenced to three months in jail, and as the lawyer just mentioned, it's up to uh, the discretion of the judge, really, but the maximum sentence under this uh, section of the Criminal Procedure Code is actually seven years. A significant order that will perhaps go a long way in uh, uh, facilitating the government's witness protection program. In New Delhi, Neha Khanna for NDTV.